you are welcome to my channel. We'll be solving this problem in geometric construction where we are told that find graphically the circumference of a circle of diameter 70 millimeter and check the result by calculation. Right? Now we are told to look for the length of the circumference of a circle. Right? First of all, we need to draw the circle. I'm going to say that this should be the base of the circle. I'll draw this out. This should be the base of the circle this way. Faint line. You can see that? And I am going to pick a point on that circle. Let's see this point here. Or better still, let me take this point here. Let me call it point what? Point D. That's what I'm taking. And I'm going to take my set square and place it on that point D where I'm going to draw a vertical line this way. See the line? This vertical line this way. Now we are told that the radius of the circle, the diameter of the circle is 70, meaning the radius is what is 35. So I'm going to place measure 35 with my meter root, which is half of the diameter, which is here, 3.5. And I'll place it at this point D here. You can see that? And I'll mark here. That's the center I'm marking. Let me call it to be my center O. You can see that? And I'll come here also at that center O this way and I'm going to complete the movement. Right? I'll complete what? The movement and I'll draw this. Now I'm going to thicken this this way. So I don't want to complete. I can easily complete it. But I only need the what? The the um, half of the circle because we know from here to here is what is 70, right? And that is the diameter. So I need the diameter of the circle. So we say this is D, I'll call it to be my D prime. Now what I'm going to do is I will take the diameter which is d to d prime you can see that you get it very well d to d prime i'll mark on this line this will be one i'll do it three times this will be two and this will be what three so this is point one point two and what and point three is that again? Now the next thing I'm going to do is the next thing I'm going to do is um, I'm going to draw a line this way from O to cut the circumference of the circle. I'll call that line. Let me say it to be point M, right? Then I'm going to place it my compass at M with radius O, right, at M with radius O, and I'll draw an arc this way, that will cut the circumference again, I'll call it what, to be what, P. Now from P, I'll use, ensure that the line I'll draw that will touch um, the line D and D prime should be perpendicular to it, so I'll be using my what, my um, T square, and I'm going to draw a line this way that way to touch this line. So where I touch, I'll call it point what? Point B. Right? So B is perpendicular to this line here. So from that point B, I'm going to draw a straight line that is going to join B and the point 3 on this point here. Right? So when I do that, from B, I'll draw a line that will touch this to this and I'll thicken it. 
So that line that I draw will be the length of what? The circumference. I'm going to measure it. If I want to measure it, I can easily start from... Let me take a longer one. I can start measuring from here to this point. So starting from 1. So meaning my 1 is 0. So from 1 to 23 means 22 since my one is zero right so from one to 23 means 22 22 right so we have uh, 220 221 222 let's say approximately 223 so the length of the circumference here is what 223 so i can just put it this way using the help of my um my lettering you can click on this link to understand better how to letter your workings this is what we have here the length of circumference is we measure it to be what 200 and what 23 right so i can just say this length you're seeing here is what 200 and what 23 and in that told of the next challenge here is we should check the result by calculation now by calculation we know very well that the length of um, the circumference of a circle l given as what 2 pi r right and if you look at it very well 2 times pi means 22 all over 7 multiplied by what r what is r r is given as the radius of the circle which is 35 since the diameter is 70, so it is what 35. So if I multiply 2 times 22 times 35 divided by 7 will give me we're having 200 and what 220. So my length here is given as what 200 and what 20 millimeter. Right? You see that it's very close. So this is how you can calculate for the graphical way in getting the circumference and the analytical way. So if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. Thanks for watching.